G'day everyone, here is the piece that I did with foam quite some time ago and I encounter a disaster. Watch what happens. Okay, so I've got my foam and somebody had asked me what brand it is well I don't know about Parfix this is just like the cheapest one well, one of the cheapest ones um, as you you know when you get something that you just want to play with experiment with and uh, you just get the cheap one so you don't you're not too much out of pocket you know so what I'm going to do is just going to go through the middle am I doing it right Yep, I sure am. Okay, so it's not happening. That means I have to have a look and see what's going on in here. So that's working. So it's coming out. So it must be this. This is the problem right here. So I'm just going to go and... Yeah, it's a little bit stuffy in there. So obviously I haven't cleaned it properly. So I'm just going to try and clean it now just to get some of that stuff out. See, it's coming out. Look at that. See that? Did you see that? That was a problem. Not anymore. All done. Let's pop you back in. Uh, a regular straw will fit this, by the way. I've already tested it. Yep, that'll work now. <laughs> get rid of that dusty stuff off me. Okay, screw it back in there. A little bit of a hiccup, not to worry. Let's go. Why isn't it working? Oh, here we go. Okay. Right. Something's going on here, and I will get to the bottom of it, that's for sure. Obviously, this is working. The stuff is coming out. But why isn't this working? Sometimes you just have to work on fixing things. Okay, here we go. Just a little hiccup. No. Nope. Maybe I need to shake it a bit better. Somebody will be watching this and laughing their heads off and saying, you're doing that wrong. I don't even know if I'm supposed to shake it, but it's definitely not coming out. I'd be buggered if I'm going to let you beat me. All right, let's see. What can I do? Poke this right in there. Okay, something's happening. Maybe. Maybe it's a little bit jammed in there. It's not letting me move. Okay. Righto, wait a second. Okay, got some pliers. Oh no, I broke the bloody thing now. Are you serious? That is not good at all. Well, that certainly is not going to help, is it? Not at all. Just pop the whole thing out.
Yeah, you've got to, it's all thick inside there. See, I'm pulling out all that thick stuff. It's going to be very interesting to to use now that I broke it. But you know what? It's good for you to see this so that you don't let this happen to you. A lot of stuff's coming out. This thing doesn't explode on me. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I've definitely buggered it. Totally. I've got a little needle. Alright. Well guys, I've given it a good go. You can see that I've given it a real good go wanting to do something if I could just get some out it would be great because I don't feel like buying another one just to finish this painting okay well if I'm destroying it I may as well destroy the whole bloody thing get rid of it at least I'll know then that I've given it all I've got. Tell you what, not happy with me. <laughs> okay, guys, what I did was I just poked my knife in there and the whole thing went, and I have got foam everywhere okay so that is i think i've just um <laughs> it's even coming off my camera look at that oh dear i think um i pumped it too many times okay let's not waste all this let's just pop it on there because it's it's supposed to be used isn't it so i'm just going to collect all of that and uh pop it on Jeez. Okay. Let's use whatever I've got. Spoons. I think I've even got some of my hair. I do. I know. Oh my god. Okay, I've got some. Be careful with this stuff. Be very careful. I I don't know if I can use okay. I just wanted to well the pliers didn't work, but the the knife, because it's nice and firm. I've got some on the floor here. I'm going to pick that up. Put it there. That was... Why did... Oh, God, you should have seen me jump. Okay? I'm just sad that I didn't re uh, record it. Um, you would have had a good laugh, that's for sure. It was a little bit scary too. But I won't brag about that. Alright. Stuff off my hair and off my phone I should be able to scrape it off the phone oh my god and that's my new phone too Ugh. anyway on with it the show must go on scrapes up some off my leg put it on there now well that worked definitely let's see if I can get some more going Where's the old knife? I'll just point it somewhere else. Oh, just a little bit coming out. Oh, wow. Okay, here we go. Oh, I've got it everywhere now. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I think I've, I've got... Oh, my God. I think this um well i know one thing for sure uh, i've used up the whole can and uh <laughs> right um is this recording guys let me just get us uh, something give me uh, give me a second one second Stick. 
is that this can all be used some other time maybe look at that oh my goodness did you have a good laugh i hope you have i hope you have see this is what can happen this is uh Lorette studios where things are never boring there's always stuff happening so that's a good thing right let's pop that over there <coughs> oh my god i'm sticky <coughs> right now let's see what i can do with this i'm going to flatten it down quite a bit please uh be careful okay be careful what you're doing um i was just uh well totally accidental i didn't purposely blow the whole can of foam <coughs> all over the place <laughs> even on some of my finished pieces which need zhuzhing up anyway so all right well this is uh quite interesting quite interesting so here's here's what happens when you kind of spread it out like like i am right here it's actually quite cool because you get that texture but it's it's kind of flattened down and it creates its own little stuff there i'm actually really loving this stuff look at that it's this little experiment is um uh, it's just created so much work for me because there's so much that i have to clean up but uh, look at that texture that's amazing absolutely amazing and looking at spreading out get it all the way to the corner there like that so that's my sand it's quite elevated now i'm um, gonna have to lay it down here fix that bit let me work on this there was another wave there but i will flatten that down so you can actually lose quite a bit of volume by doing this but you're getting a really nice texture and see how yellow it's getting i will paint that at the moment i'm not even worried about my lines where i had them my outlines on where my beach is where my wave is i'm kind of following it a little bit but i'm working very fast because i don't want to lose all this goodness and uh wow well everything decided to bubble up really big so i'm just gonna have to cut cut it and look at the mess this is the next day look at that look at my i've already tried to scrape some of that stuff off before Come around here. Just sorry, I've got cords and everything. Um, there, there, down here. <laughs> that stuff just went everywhere. What this was meant to be, where's my other piece? Here it is. Continuation of this piece and mounted on a nice long piece of uh, MDF board so that was supposed to be a wave going up there and over here um, but I don't know it, it, this is too big now be shaved down which I don't think would be hard to do but I'm thinking maybe I can create something else that they can maybe be hills or something like that um, it's not hard to cut it cuts pretty easy but it just seems like it's going to be a big job something so simple you now you have these simple things in mind and then they turn into a huge job and that is usually me it usually happens to me
all the time. Let me know if this happens to you in the comments. Share with me your story when you started doing something and it turned into something completely different. So, okay. I could keep these, but I've already got a bag for, for you know, future texture projects. So, should get a bigger knife to cut this. And, well, I might be able to just pull it off, break it off. That one will never break. No way. I've got to cut through that one. Oh my gosh, what to do, what to do. Okay, so I've decided with this one what I'm going to do is, it's a shame to cut this. Um, it's, it's just sort of sitting beautifully there. Um, I, I decided to lead them into hills and mountains and down here a little bit as well and then have maybe like a river going through and it's an aerial view and it's a real effective 3D like a sculpture um, piece even so that's what I'm going to do with this I will however get rid of some of these just cut them flat see because if I went with that what I was planning on doing um, it's not going to be the same. See, this is nice and bubbly. And uh, I had two goes at this. First, I had one, one wave here with the foam. And then I added another one onto it. So, And I kind of did a different thing. So it didn't go crazy like this one. Um, but if I cut this, it'll be flat and it won't be a continuous thing. So I 